How that work? How you win the war for doing something good, but not doing a good thing? Do she need to, do she want me to ask the, the do, she, do she need to ask me a question? I have been slacking so bad on my ACL updates, journeys, blase, blase. It is week seven, about to be week eight tomorrow. And I told y'all I was gonna update y'all at five weeks and that did not happen. We're still technically in week seven and I am on my way to physical therapy. I don't think I can film in physical therapy, but I'm gonna test my luck today and I'll be like, hey, I need to film this, so let me film this. Okay, as soon as I hit five weeks, stuff started to pick back up. Week six hit, I'm like, okay, I can do this. Week seven hit and I couldn't walk. Basically, I've reached a point where I'm in the stage now where my graph is stretching, is pulling, is getting weaker. I don't have enough muscle in my legs, so it's gonna be harder for me to walk, harder for me to do daily activities and stuff like that. It's gonna be a lot of pain, and that's what I'm going through. And that started week seven, and I'm like, okay, nobody prepared me for this, nobody told me this. Here we are. I gotta get gas real fast, y'all. I'm pushing it. Physical therapy starts at 11. Ask me what time it is. It is 10.54. But that's okay, stay right here. So I'm about to scurry on down to physical therapy. I'm gonna try my absolute darnest to pull this camera out. Y'all, so I'll see y'all there. Straight to a penthouse, Miami Beach. Hey, yo. Talk crazy on tweets. Who? They don't want it cause I come to defeat. They don't want it. I beat the nips all sweet. sweet. Bamboo sticks all in the cheek. <laughs> it's a new weirdo every week. Weirdo. Get the work, put it up for my seeds. No care for the IG. This no do anything for club. Anything, do anything for club. I recorded what I could. My last update, I've just been doing the same exercises. We've only been adding weight, and that's about it. The only thing that's like majorly different, my stretching was different this week. My physical therapist was out on vacation. She's been gone for 10 days. So I've been going to someone else. And this week we've started working on my hamstring. It is extremely painful, so painful, especially stretching it and like putting pressure on it. It hurts so bad, like so bad. It's almost unbearable. We gotta get this leg to straighten up because it's not, it's, it's, it's straight, but it's not as straight as it need to be. But yeah, that's the deal with that. Let me get back to work and then I will catch up with y'all later. Welcome back guys. The last time y'all saw me was June 23rd. It is now June 29th. I did not vlog that second, my second day of physical therapy that week because I just did the same stuff. Okay, I just left Panera y'all. I'm about to run some errands. I need to go on home goods. I wanna find me this roommate cup and find Bubby like some shoes and some more clothes. But anyways, it is week eight and nothing much has really changed. Everything is pretty much still the same. The new thing we're trying to work on now is getting my leg to straighten all the way out and get to negative three degrees. I'm at about um, zero right now, but I need to be at negative three so it can match my other leg. I have my six week follow up next Tuesday. So I will keep y'all updated on that too, even though it'll be nine weeks. I don't, I don't. Mm. Um, but yeah, I got me a Chipotle chicken avocado sandwich from Panera. And some chai chips. I'm about to eat this real quick. Go in here after I go on Home Goods. I need to go in TJ Maxx. I need to return these ugly overalls I bought. And then I need to go to CVS. And that's gonna complete my day. <laughs> Yesterday, as I was telling y'all, I was going to a few stores. Well, it was very unsuccessful. And I also need to get my nails done. Look at this. Look at this. Look at this. Yeah, my vlogs are so boring right now because it's, I'm just, life is just boring right now. <laughs> so my vlogs are gonna be boring. So just, Please hold because life will get better and my vlogs will get better. 
I know y'all probably don't like hearing me talk all day, every day on the darn camera, but here we are. I was literally looking at old pictures from early this year in February when I won the best vlogger award, award in my city and realized I don't even be vlogging. How that work? How you win the award for doing something good but not doing a good thing? You're not vlogging, which is what you won the award for. Freddy's is where we are. We's at Freddy's getting a burger. A burger. Oh, I forgot to show y'all. Also with the Ulta. And I got some Fenty Skin Tint, shade 16. I hope this is my shade because I feel like everything in Fenty is just orange on me. <sighs> it's just hard to find my freaking shade, y'all. This camera is giving orange and red and I'm not that. Um, but we're about to try to put this on with our hands and see. Oh, we love that. Whoa. And we're gonna start using skin tint and moisturize and CC cream, BB creams, all the creams for the summer. Cause for one, it feel like a freaking furnace outside. It's so mother freaking hot. Oh, please hold. So can I get the, is it the double steak burger? The, just the regular? So we're probably not going to wear shoes because it's raining now, so. What I really need to do is go home and clean my room. Just wait till y'all see my room. It's actually pretty trifling, but. I don't know if I showed y'all this wallet I got from Coach. I'm a Coach girly. I've always been a Coach girly before all the girlies even jumped on Coach, okay? I've been a Coach girl since middle school. And I just got this wallet and it's just so cute. Fits right in my Tory Burch bag. Okay, I have to go down because this camera about to die, so. Bubby's so black, you can't even see him on the camera. Y'all, it is <sighs> July 1st. So freaking crazy. July 1st, it has been two whole months since my surgery. Had surgery, ACL, hamstring graft, April 30th, it's been two months. That's just insane to even think about. And here I am still struggling. That's crazy. But it's getting better. It's not as bad as it was a month ago. So yeah, April, May, June, yeah. <laughs> it's been two months. It's been two months. But here we are at physical therapy. I'm about to go in. I'm gonna try to vlog today. And if I don't, then I'll just update y'all. So, fingers crossed. Oh, tomorrow's July 2nd. Tomorrow marks week nine. And I also have my six week follow-up. My first follow-up after my surgery tomorrow. Let's try three rounds of six-ish. And yeah, it doesn't even have to be that low. Does it feel okay? Mm-hmm. Um, okay. Cakes this way. I'm just going to have you put it around your ankles. And then just do steps. That way. You got this. Hey, I got this. Two in here is not made a big part of spaghetti and frozen. Is that my style? Yes. <laughs> the Mr. Was it Royal Moral? Mr. Royal? Yes, no. Why? I don't know. That's my style. Yep. And you didn't like any of them? Maybe I didn't listen again. Maybe I didn't uh, like the process. Let's keep that on and do the kick. Okay. Watching them hurdles this weekend. Thank you, buddy. It makes me sad. Every time they land, I'm just like, oh, we're trying to just waiting on an ACL. Just like my actual thing. Feels like I'm at the gym. So, same thing you were doing on the flat ground. Standing and just kind of balancing on the leg. The foam's going to be uneven. Sometimes I just wanna disappear Running out till I can feel you near I need a new purpose Okay, y'all, I'm gonna update y'all real fast. 
I just left physical therapy and really just off the phone with my insurance. My stupid insurance, I hate the way American insurance is. I hate medical insurance. I hate all of it. They been mailing me like this won't be covered and this won't be covered because the Americans, something society don't deem it as necessary. They think that my physical therapy is a medical necessity and not a requirement. And I wanna say that is bull S-H-I-T. And I literally just got the phone with my insurance like, okay, who's calling these shots? Here comes my darn. Okay, why are they calling me? Hello? Hey, I know your insurance um, just called. They were trying to explain to you what was going on with your insurance did they explain it correctly like do you understand now their information is not right and they've been sending me um they've been sending me like letters physical therapy being deemed as a medical necessity so the man was confused they, they can't ever speak good english for it and i think they'd be confused i'm just like yes don't, don't make my patient confused because you're confused to me and i know yes <laughs> <laughs> well, okay you too bye, bye. See, see what I'm telling, see what I'm saying? Insurance is so ghetto. Cigna is ghetto. I don't understand. I really don't. Like half the time these people don't speak English. It's so hard for them to understand what I'm saying. So hard for me to even understand a sentence that they're saying. And I call my insurance because I got two letters in the mail with confusing information. So I call just to make sure, hey, is y'all's information correct? Because I just, I don't understand what's going on. And he's like, well, you've only had seven um, physical therapy sessions and you should have plenty more, so it'll be covered. And I'm like, okay, that's not making no sense because I've been in physical therapy since May, the beginning of May. And at physical therapy, they're telling me my last visit is on Wednesday. But you sitting here telling me I've only had seven visits? I know that ain't right. So I told him the math ain't math and to recalculate. So he puts me on hold. He calculates again. He's like, yeah, you're right. You're right. You've been 14 visits. That's you're wrong again, buddy. Cause I haven't been 14 visits. It's been way more than that. You know how many times I've been going to physical therapy. My question is to you is, is, is y'all stuff right on y'all's end? Because y'all sending me these darn letters. So he calls my physical therapist and I don't know what the heck he told her, but she calls me back. She's like, I just want to make sure I'm not, we're not like confusing you, blah, blah, blah. No. Insurance don't speak English don't speak good english at that and they're confusing themselves this week might be the last week y'all see me at physical therapy because honestly truthfully i'm over this whole situation i'm over it all my six week follow-up is at nine weeks which is tomorrow that's cra that's the first crazy thing like and i this whole nine weeks i just feel like i've just been in the dark my surgeon hasn't really been communicating with me about what I should be doing, what I shouldn't be doing. This whole time, we couldn't even find my darn medical plan on the website. It's just been, it's been too much. Too much, but also not enough. And my insurance is just stupid. So tomorrow, after my appointment, I'm going to ask him, is everything good? You need to tell me what I should be doing, what I shouldn't be doing, so I can just flow on by this on my own. Because you've been no help. My insurance have been no help. And that's just how I want to go about it because it's too much. And I'm too young to be stressing and getting gray hairs. That's the update, y'all. Not sure if this is the update y'all wanted to hear, but these people got me messed up. So that's that. I'm going back to work now and I'll see you on the next update. Can y'all see me? I've tried crumble cookie once before and it was absolutely disgusting. So, we're going to try it again. I got, I don't know why I was craving crumbles so bad. Like, it is disgusting to me. But I got a mini pack because they got minis now. And we got, we got sugar cookie. I don't know what this is. Maybe apple. I don't know. Apple something. And I think chocolate chip cookie. But this one is what I'm most excited for. This is strawberry shortcake. Like she is literally staring so hard right now. Do she need to, do she want me to ask the, the do, she, do she need to ask me a question? Am I ugly? Okay, anyways. Ew, it's just so, it just sounds so squishy. Like what, where's the crunch? Okay, here we go.
the sugar one, I would give that one a 7 out of 10. Apple pie? But let's break a piece off of here. Mmm. 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 That one gets a 4 out of 10 for me. Yee. Yeah. Okay, chocolate chip. Hmm. Okay. Chocolate chip one is the best one. Okay, let's try this. It looks like it's gonna be too much, but strawberry shortcake. Now what the heck? Not bad. I would give this one a 8.5 out of 10. All in all, the chocolate chip was my favorite. The sprinkle was next to favorite. The apple, whatever that is, it's got to go. Wasn't good at all. And the shortcake was good. Yeah. That's my crumble cookie rating. I'm staying simple, I ain't never ever bugging. If I'm doing good, cool, I ain't never stunting. I keep it real, fuck it, y'all know how I'm coming. So if I die, tell the government I seen it coming. <laughs>